everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Neelam Ahuja. You can also reach me on Instagram at neelam.ahuja. I apologize, this video is a little delayed. Coming to you, I wanted to talk about the patch foods, but I was waiting for them to arrive. And they have, and I know I've talked about the other version of the patch boots, which are the patch knee-high boots. These are the patch ankle boots. I will talk about the overall style and we'll go over price and sizing and uh, how to style and comfort. Let's talk about the, the style and the difference between this and the knee-high. This, much like the knee-high boot, is also on a low stacked heel. It is a square toed boot. It's a shiny leather. This one versus the other one has an overlay piece of leather, a curved overlay piece of leather that is sewn onto the top that gives this boot a little bit of detail at the toe where the knee high boot is just smooth leather all the way up and it doesn't have this overlaid patch. Of course, the knee high goes all the way just below the knee and this is above the ankle. They call it, some people call it the ankle. I just, I think it's more like a, just below a mid calf. It's an excellent pair of boots for jeans and skirts and everything. I, the leather is, is really nice on this, but it is shiny and I imagine, I haven't taken them out yet, but I imagine it's going to scratch. I'm not so concerned about it. The, on the side there, there's a, a zip uh, closure with a pull tab and it's a very easy on and off boot. This uh, boot right now, the uh, pricing is around 1350 US dollars. Some of the colors as I've seen on sale and gone half price and uh, if you're lucky enough to find them at that price. I was hoping these would go on sale but of course the black was not put on sale and I didn't really want to wait and not find my size. Let's talk about sizing. The issue with sizing on the patch boots is because, I mentioned this in the other video with the knee high boot, because there are, they're a square toe, they're a little more forgiving at the front of the boot. I wouldn't recommend for the knee high that you size down but if you absolutely have to, because you can't find your size, you could. For the patch ankle boot, this particular style, you would want to size down. These do fit large. In fact, I put on the six and a half and thought I could get away with it, but I was slipping out of the boot and moving around. That's how big they were for me. But I do have a slightly narrow foot, not very narrow, but slightly more narrow. However, I'm a true 36 and a half, and I still took the 36 and I still have room. I can get a thin sock on, so I would recommend half size down. In terms of comfort, they are a comfortable boot, very comfortable actually. A low heel, square toe, that's naturally how our foot um, is shaped at the front, right? We're always trying to jam our feet into pointed toe boots and that just doesn't work and it's rarely comfortable, but these are comfortable because they, they, they go with the flow of our foot and uh, like I said, a low heel. And it's a soft leather, so it's going to give a little as well. No issue there. Styling endless uh, styling and like I, I really think that this is a, an, a boot that could go with everything because uh, easily wearing them under jeans of course you're going to see that little extra overlaid piece of leather at the front which is a nice thing uh, when you're, the rest of your outfit isn't so dolled up. With a skirt it's going to look fantastic. I think they're an elegant boot uh, to be worn with pretty much everything. Now, the reason I chose this version versus the knee high is because the knee height is a lot of boot for me. I'm short and it hit right right below my knee and I loved it, but I, I was really trying to give consideration to a couple of things. One, the price and the weight of it because they, they're a bit, they're not heavy, but they, they feel, you, you know you're wearing a knee high boot as you walk in them. And I thought, well, this is great if I'm wearing a shorter skirt and you can see the top of the boot and it, cause it's meant to be shown, but if it isn't, then maybe I could get away with a shorter version of it if it's the square toe that I'm after. And then the price comes down a bit as well. If I had endless cash, I would have both in my closet because the other boot is just gorgeous. It's elegant and sexy too. And even on a low heel, I really like it. But for now, this is the boot for me. And this is the one I'll be wearing with, uh, with everything when I'm wanting a little bit of a heel. That is your patch ankle review.